Hey guys, Trevor here, and in this video, I'm gonna walk you through how to fix your cellular data on your iPhone if it's not working. It's pretty quick and easy, so let's jump right in. If you're on your iPhone and you're trying to use your cellular data, you're trying to load a web page or anything like that, and it's just not working, I'll walk you through a few different steps. It's a little bit hard, hard to diagnose, but we'll go through a bunch of different steps that should be getting your cellular data working again. Now, the very first thing that you'll want to do is just swipe down from the top right. Now, you can see at the top left here a little green um, cellular kind of tower looking thing, and it's you know highlighted in green. Now, if I toggle that off, it looks like that. You'll want to make sure that it is toggled on so that you're accepting and, and the cellular network is turned on on your phone. So that's the first step. Of course, that's the easiest. Now let's head into settings here. And to make sure that your cellular ne network is working, we'll just tap on cellular right here about midway down the screen. And you can see a variety of different options that we'll go through. So it says cellular data. Of course, that's toggled on. If it's not working, try to toggle it off and then try to toggle it back on again after a few seconds. Now under cellular data options, we'll tap on that and you'll want to make sure all of these are kind of toggled on. Data roaming is toggled on, voice and data, you want it to be on auto, 5G auto, and data mode, and you'll want to choose allow more data on 5G. And this basically helps to speed up your cellular network. Now, once we've gone through all these steps, what you might want to do at this point is just restart your phone. So hold down the power button and the volume up button and it'll pop up with a little option and you can slide to power off your phone. Now, once you've done that and restarted your phone, if your cellular network is still not working, there are a few different steps that you can do. Now, we've gone through a few different steps on your phone. However, maybe you just have bad signal where you're at. So at the very top, you can see the number of bars, but that sometimes can be deceiving. If you have another device, say a friend's phone or something like that, that's on the same cellular network, AT&T, Verizon, whatever, um, then you can check their network. And if theirs is fast and working well and yours isn't, that's an indication there's an issue with your phone. However, if they're both really slow or not working at all, that might be an indication that the cellular network just isn't working in that area. Um, and then you can connect to some kind of Wi-Fi or something like that to be able to use it. Now, the last option that I'll walk you through is kind of the, the definitely something that will help you and kind of reset all of these cellular network issues. So we'll head back out of here and we'll go down to just general. Once we're in general, we'll scroll down until you see transfer or reset iPhone. And when we're there, we'll tap reset. And then you'll see the second option is to reset network settings. We can tap that and that'll give us a, you know, a passcode. We can enter that in and then it'll say this will delete all of your network settings, returning them to factory defaults. So this goes through the steps to kind of reset all of those internal cellular data settings and that should get everything working again on your cellular network. The very last thing you can do potentially is that it's a SIM card issue. Maybe you have a SIM card issue, try making a phone call. If you can make a phone call and that works perfectly fine, your SIM card is probably okay. But if you've gone through all these steps and your cellular network still doesn't work and you're in a good spot with good signal, then you might need to take it to an Apple store and see what's going on. There might be an underlying issue with your iPhone. Hope this helps. Let us know if you have any questions in the comments below. Make sure to subscribe. Thanks.